Time is up for people who wanted to appeal a decision to close their parish. The Archdiocese gave groups until today to send a letter to the Archbishop. This comes as the All Things New plan would reshape 178 Catholic parishes into 134. Today, our Justina Coronel spoke to one couple trying to save St. Francis of Assisi in Portage de Sioux. Justina. Yeah, Mike and Ann, so the Bowers tell me they've been going to this church for 25 years, and it's been a special place for them. It's a spot where their children received all of their sacraments, but now their parish will merge with another one in St. Charles. It's been a place of worship in Portage de Sioux for more than 200 years. St. Francis of Assisi has served St. Charles County families for generations. I'm a parishioner. I've been coming to this parish for 25 years now. Parishioner Lori Bauer has seen the church face several hurdles. The church survived 18 inches of water in the 1993 flood. And now Lori thinks the church faces its biggest obstacle yet. Your parish will be subsumed into St. Charles Barmeo Parish. This letter was read to parishioners at the end of May. That's why the Bowers are trying to say the church from merging with St. Charles Borromeo Parish in St. Charles, which could be a 20 to 40 minute drive for some. The Archdiocese gave these reasons for its decision. Past flooding causing a decline in the population and the parish having 68 Catholic households. And that the parish averaged just two infant baptisms and zero funerals annually for the past five years. Her husband Doug Bauer believes the area will grow. We have 30,000 acres down here that have portion of is in St. Francis Parish boundaries that is prime for development. The couple is now appealing to the Archbishop. We have received 149 personal letters. The one that touched us the most, she's 98 years old. Her family goes back seven generations. She comes every week. She can't make the drive. As Lori carries the decree in her hand, she also holds on to hope, having faith that the parish can survive. I truly feel like this is a cornerstone to this community. The Archbishop has 30 days to review every single letter and he will respond directly to each one written. Starting August 1st, the priest reassignments will begin and the changes will continue until 2026. Justina.